Hello everyone. Welcome to Stockholm, Sweden and ATG. My name is Hasse Lord Skarplöt and I'm the CEO of ATG, but I'm also the vice chairman of Vota. Here we are in uh, our studio plant where we deliver 24/7 racing broadcasts to uh, our 1.4 million Swedish customers and to all our partners all over the world. But we're not just a horse betting company anymore. Since uh, January 1st, 2019, we also offer sports booking and casino online to our customer base. Overall, this makes us uh, the, the by far biggest betting operator in Sweden on the commercial license market. I became the CEO of ATG in 2013 and I have a background before uh, ATG within the television industry, both in, uh, on the Swedish market and on the Nordic market. And when I'm not the CEO, I'm uh, fully occupied driving my kids to and from different sports activities. Besides that, I try to maintain my weight and my former strength as an ice hockey goalie. I'm not that uh, successful, to be, to be fair. And another personal objective of mine in 2021 is to become single handicapper in golf. Let's see whether I will succeed or not. But that's enough about me. Let's talk about ATG. ATG was formed by the Swedish state in 1974. ATG is fully owned by the Swedish Trotting Association and the Swedish Thoroughbred Association, where the state still has a board majority. All our surplus goes back to the sport. And last year we handed over a record amount of 270 million uh, euro to the Swedish uh, horse racing. We are proud to offer customers Sweden's largest pool bet in V75 where you pick out the winner in seven different races. Every Saturday, V75 has a turnover of around 10 million euro and last year V75 paid out 292 wins bigger than 100,000 euro. And right here in this very studio, uh, we broadcast V75 every Saturday. And we do it on the biggest Swedish commercial TV uh, channel and we have around 450,000 Swedish viewers each Saturday. The V75's increasingly fast-growing sibling is the V86, which runs on Wednesdays. The difference, except that there are eight races, is that the races run simultaneously on two different tracks. We have thus reduced the time between races so that all eight races are decided in less than an hour and a half. V86, which also is broadcasted on a national uh, TV channel, has increased in popularity over the last years. Uh, we have more viewers and we have doubled the turnover and currently we have around 3 million euro in turnover each Wednesday. That has made V86 the second largest pool bet here in Sweden. At ATG, we have a clear vision, and that is to deliver to our customers the world's best gaming experience. Our two biggest challenges in order to do so are, to start with, uh, to do things a little, little bit better than we do currently in terms of gaming experience. It could be big things, it could be small things, it's uh, everything from brands, services, and how easy it is to become a customer of ATG. In order to do so, we primarily do not look at what competitors are doing in the area. Uh, instead, we are looking and trying to get inspiration from other companies in other industries I would say primarily in the entertainment business uh, because there are so much we could learn from other industries. Second challenge for us is to continue to build uh, our new products being 
sportsbook and casino online. We are humble beginners uh, in these areas. We have had the products for two years available to our customers. Two quite uh, successful years in, in terms of customers and in terms of turnover. But we need to continue to build uh, these products in order to be successful in the future. These two challenges must be carried out in the light of responsible gambling. A customer plays for pleasure and feels good in the gambling will become a long-term ATG customer. In other words, gambling responsibility are good both for our customers and for our company. Since last year, I have been the vice president of uh, VOTA. For me, VOTA is an uh, important uh, phenomena because parimutuel and horse racing are a global phenomena. And the more we could learn from each other, the more competitive we will become. Another interest of mine is to try to get more synergies out of the Nordic uh, region via VOTA. In the Nordics, we have seven federations. We have plus four gambling companies offering pretty much the same product to the Nordic citizens. Question I ask myself is uh, why do these four gambling companies have four different horse betting systems when we offer pretty much the same products? Why does this seven federation have different sport information systems when, where they gather pretty much the same information? And third thing, why do we have different rules in the sport in the different uh, countries uh, confusing our customers more than needed. Like I said, I see economies of scales, I see synergies and I see opportunity to simplify for the customers by joining forces up here in the north. That's another objective of mine with VOTA. Finally, what is the best sport experience that I've experienced? Quite easy answer on that one. The best one always happens last Sunday in May at Solvalla in Stockholm. Let's have a look at this. Nice, wasn't it? I hope to see you all very soon at Elite Loppet, uh, perhaps already next year. Over and out from Stockholm.